We'll start with the, an opening remarks. I'll, open, I'll give the opening remarks, but also go straight to the agenda. Uh, let me do the opening remarks, then uh, I'll also welcome the party leader to give his uh, remarks. Uh, then uh, after he finishes giving his uh, remarks to the delegates, uh, I'll pick it up and uh, run the agenda in the shortest time possible. Uh, for those who are new, my name is Felipe Saja, the Secretary General of Chama Chauzal Lendo. I want also to say that uh, this is the National Delegates Conference, which is supposed to be held every after five good years. As a matter of statutory requirement for the party and the law. So today, for us to invite you for the third National Delegates Conference is because it's a requirement by law, and also it's a platform where all our members at the grassroots level join hands together mm -hmm. to ratify positions that have been taken by the national election, the national executive council of the party. And uh, the members of the National Delegates Conference is about a third of the number of the counties um, in Kenya. That is approximately not less than eight uh, uh, counties. Today, we are meeting more than uh, 10 counties. That's approximately 11 counties. Um, and uh, the National Executive Council is also a member of the National Delegates Conference. We also have uh, elected members of either parliament and uh, that is, uh, we also have uh, members of uh, elected in parliament or uh, county assemblies as members mm -hmm. of uh, uh, the National Delegates Conference. Uh, I want to confirm officially that uh, we have the quorum. Can I continue because there's somebody? Second day, we are losing you. Yeah, can you hear me? I'm, I'm here. I'm here. I'm good. I'm good. I... Uh, party leader, can you hear me? Okay, maybe, maybe I can also unmute on my side. Am I good? Am I good? Okay, maybe I can also unmute on my side. Am I good? Unmute on my side on my phone? I've muted. I'm good? Party leader, can you hear me? Asante sana. I want to confirm to the National Delegates Conference that uh, from the roll call that we have done, we have the quorum to hold this uh, National Delegates Conference. I want also to confirm that we have the National Executive Council 
uh, in attendance with two apologies from uh, the national chairman, uh, Olen Tutu, who, who mm -hmm. was unable to join us today because of uh, personal program at uh, uh, the grassroots level. Uh, please, the alcohol. Control the alcohol, please. Uh, are, we, are we good? Um, I also want to register uh, another apology from uh, Irene Duko, the National Women League chairperson, who is currently in a meeting of Azimio uh, Women League chairperson in Nairobi. All the 25 political parties chairperson of the Women League are having a meeting currently. I want also to confirm that we have our beloved party leader uh, uh, in the house, uh, Nzioka Waita, the immediate former chief of staff in the office of the president. Um, I have not gone, and I'm not allowed right now to go through the list of the National Executive Council members who are in attendance, because when I do that, I'll be distorting my uh, duties right now. But I'm sure that uh, there are a number of NEC members in attendance right now, and I congratulate you people for joining us because this is the first time we are doing a virtual national delegates conference as a party. Uh, I don't have much to say at this particular time and moment, but I'm very happy for the work that uh, has been done at the county levels. All the chairmen from all the 11 plus counties I want to thank you very much for being available, for doing your duties as officials at the county level. I also want to thank all the officials at the county level, the delegates, all the five delegates from all the county levels. Thank you for being committed to Chama Chauzalendo. We will not be where we are if uh, you are not committed, you are not supportive, and even sometimes being there when things are really down, many challenges, but until now, it's a confirmation that this is a very strong party, if at all we have gone through all that we have gone through all those years. For 2022, I want to confirm also to the National Delegates Conference that we have more than, and I'm doing this because it's important, we have more than 109 aspirants running all over the country currently. Only a few numbers, less from the 100 and uh, 27 in 2017. Uh, again, I want also to say that for the second time, we have our own party leader running for the governor of Machakos. And our goal is to make sure that he clinches that seat, not only as a party leader, but he becomes the second governor of Machakos County. Um, we have also met all the compliance issues according to law from the Office of the Registrar Political Party, from IABC. And I want to thank 
every single person who have helped us meet this statutory requirement. It has not been easy, but I want to confirm to you that uh, God has helped us uh, do this uh, in a smooth manner. Uh, I've already given you all the important matters, and I want only to thank you for being here today with us. And I want to take this chance to welcome the new party leader of Chama Chosalendo, Juan Zioka Waita, to our party Salam, Aonge na Nyini, na Nipatia Rusa, Hili Niweze Kupeana, Amokuskuma, Agenda Etu ya Leo, eh, Ambai Niamuimu, Pia, Katika Mambo ya kutimiza sheria ambaye tutakana kutimiza kulingana na ofisi ya rejisua wa political parties. Tumkaribishe moja wetu party leader Mzioka Waita. Asante sana, party leader. Atu jambo. Asante sana. 
Asante sana. Uh, Am I on? Uh, asante sana uh, party leader. Tumefurahi sana kwa hiyo hotuba yako ambayo imefurahisha uh, delegates wetu. Pia nimeweza ku kuwa informed naambiwa uh, the deputy party leader ame to join and I will, I'll, 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 I'll want to ask her, uh, madam Florence Mwangangi the speaker of the county assembly of Machakos uh, to take this moment and you give your remarks to the National Delegates Conference of Chama Teuzalendo. Karibu sana, Madam Speaker. She has just joined. I'm not sure if at all she has uh, relaxed. Uh, because you know, when we are bosses. Walk around, you you give them a space before you run the agenda. Madam Speaker. Aisha, mute, tafadali. Mute. Okay. Okay. I'll request, with the permission of the party leader, I run the agenda because I'm not sure how many schedules that we have today. Uh, 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 Madam Speaker will inform us when she's ready and she'll be given an opportunity to say hi to the National Delegates Conference because I know that uh, she is also your deputy governor. And let, let us proceed. I'm sure she will join us and uh, we can address you later. Thank you, sir. Let me read the notice of the virtual National Delegates Conference, which was given on the 13th of April, 2022. Uh, notice was given of Chama Chazalenjo Virtual National uh, ne Delegates Conference meeting according to Article 10, 3, 10, 4, and 21, 1, 6 of the party constitution. That was to be held today on the 5th of May, 2022, starting from 10.30 a.m., going to 2 p.m., but we are not going to reach 2 p.m. It was supposed to be done either through Zoom or Google Meet link, which has been already shared with the delegates through the county coordinators to protect the integrity of the National Delegates Conference. And the agendas of today, one was to ratify the changes that were proposed for the National Elections Council, uh, Council and confirm the list of the National Executive Council according to the Office of the Registrar of Political Parties. And the second agenda was to be any other business as approved by the National Executive Council. That is the notice that was given and signed on the 13th of April, 2022. This was also published in the newspapers for everyone to see. It was also published in the website www.ccuparty.co.ke With the permission from uh, the party leader, I want to go straight to the resolutions prepared for today. 
um, uh, on this 5th of May 2022, the National De Delegates Convention, um, the resolution of the National Delegates Convention held today, uh, the National Delegates Convention is hereby held virtually today morning via Google Meet link, which has been shared with you. And among the matters that is hereby discussed are the changes in the party leadership, um, and uh, the first uh, resolution to be uh, resolved is one that the national exam the deputy party leader or uh, Florence Mongangi as the deputy party leader we have the chairperson Olen Tutu. We have uh, the deputy chairperson, um, Ma Madam uh, Faith Ndonge. We have uh, the, the national youth chairperson, Bernard Charlo. We have the National Organizing Secretary, uh, Davis Musau, Patrick Davis Musau. We have the Secretary for Election, Dr. Jimmy Jackson Mutunga. We have uh, um, Asha Wanje as the Deputy uh, Women League Chairperson. We have Irene Nuku as a National Chairperson for Women League. We have uh, um, the Deputy Youth uh, Youth League, uh, Mutindi, Mike, I think Mutindi, Mike. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just using my the list in my mind. But I can see it uh, being uh, broadcasted. Uh, that is. Yeah, I can see it here. Yeah. Uh, Sylvester is controlling, it's not me. Yeah, so, so I should follow there. Okay, that uh, the resolution on the table is uh, that the NEC officials list be ratified as approved by NEC and the Office of the Registrar of Political Parties. This list is available uh, through the chairpersons from the counties and the delegates who are a part of the National Delegates Conference and a part of the county executive uh, committee. I'm very sure that you have that list with you. I've tried my best to read uh, the names from my mind, uh, waiting for the list. But uh, that is the first uh, uh, resolution that I want us to pass today that we are passing this list, we are ratifying, we are confirming this list according to what has been approved by the Registrar of Political Parties. I want a proposer and I want a seconder on that.
I want a proposer who is a delegate. You say your name. You say your county. Then I get a, pro a seconder who will also say his or her name and the county. First proposer. You are a delegate? You are a delegate. Please, please. I propose. I want a proposer who is a delegate. Repeat your name. Gabriel Gabriel Wasi Kaingo from Kilefe. You you propose that is written down. Now I want a seconder from a different county. Please. Ah, oh, yes. Valentine Ogedi from Kisi is seconds. Thank you very much. The, the first resolution is hereby concluded and confirmed. The list from the Registrar Political Party of the National Executive Council is officially confirmed by the National Delegates Conference 2022. The second resolution is we want to confirm and to ratify Florence Muoti Mwangangi to assume the role of the deputy party leader of Chama Chauzalendo. So we hereby unanimously resolve that Florence Muoti Mwangangi assumes the role of deputy. We say your name and county. I have not had. No. Mute, 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 everyone, mute, mute, everyone, except the person who wants to propose. Daniel Joguna Mwangi from Kirinyaga County propose, proposes from Kirinyaga County. I'm on mute. Uh, can you hear me? So Daniel Joguna Mwangi proposes Florence Moti Mwangangi to assume the office of the deputy party leader from Kirinyaga. Now I want a seconder from another county. Florence, uh, Daniel, uh, Diana Mukaya from Kwale County seconds Florence Moti Mwangangi to assume the position of deputy party leader. Thank you very much. That has been recorded. Now, this is a hot one. But we have to do it. That it is hereby proposed that one Alex Gitonga Nyaga to be replaced by Masi Kibuda Mutriri as the new elected secretary for information and communication. I repeat, that it is proposed 
that one Alex Gitonga Nyaga be replaced with Masi Kibuda Mutwiri as the new elected Secretary for Information and Communication. I need a proposal from a new county and a seconder from another county. <laughs> Kenneth Lel from Nandi County proposes that Alex Gitonga Nyaga is replaced during election by Masi Kibuda Mutwiri. Yes. I want a seconder from another county. A seconder. That is Brian. We can't hear you, Brian. I need to get your name. I, I can't hear you. I have not picked your name. I have not picked the county. Anyone who is on go mute. Brian, mute if at all you are not speaking. I want another delegate who can be well. Who? Lucy Atieno from Kajiado. Lucy Atieno from Kajiado seconds that Alex Nyaga Gitonga be replaced during an election by Masi Kibuda Mtriri to become the new elected secretary for information and communication. Thank you very much for that seconding. Makofi. The last resolution is that the party constitution to be adapted as it is and approved by the office of the registrar of political party. I need a proposal from a different county name and the county, and the seconder name and the county. Yes, I propose. I propose Richard Osonko from Kwale County. Richard Osonko from Kwale County proposes that the new constitution as approved by the Registrar Political Party to be adapted by the National Delegates Conference. I need another seconder delegate from a different county. Seconder. Yes. Yes. Robert Musse. Robert Musse is a delegate. We want a delegate. Thank you, Robert. We want a delegate from Nairobi. Thank you. Andrew Ngula seconds the adoption of the constitution of the party as approved by the Office of the Registrar Political Party. Makofi Tafadali, Asante San. This is where I say I'm proud that we have passed a resolution of the party for compliance purposes. And this will be registered. It will be communicated to the Office of the Registrar Political Party immediately that we 
conclude the National Delegates Conference. And without much ado, I want to say I've finished my duty as a Secretary General to guide you through adoption of the resolution of today. Party leader, I'm proud of your people. Your party is now compliant.
wote wame sign resolution kwa kaunti zao wame sign participants list kwa nini yao na zote zitufikie na tuwafanya mambo yetu immediately asanteni sana mbarikiwe Thank you very much to our party leader and the uh, deputy party leader and secretary general for, for those wonderful remarks. Uh, just to recap, we were in a roll call of the plan and purpose, and uh, we were left with the two between locking and hiding. If you are still on, please confirm for record purposes. I've seen one of the delegates standing. Maybe they are using the phone. Kindly, please. McLean team, show up. I think they are still experiencing the technical challenges, but at least we've seen them uh, when they were connecting and uh, disconnecting. So thank you very much. And at this point, I'd like to invite uh, Madam Faith to give us a vote of thanks. Madam Faith, over to you, please. Thank you. Faith Julia? Yes, in a moment. Both of them, Dr. Okay. And I, I kindly take this opportunity to thank the organizers to thank everybody who has participated, to thank everybody whose input is felt even right now, to thank our party leader and to congratulate them, both the party leader and our able deputy party leader. We believe with your guidance, we believe with your able leadership, we'll move to the other level and I pray for good returns, I pray for good success, and I pray to have a party that every Kenyan will be proud to be associated with. I'm humbled once again for every delegate who's gotten time to be with us, who's paired every single moment to be with us in this virtual meeting. It is a success. Lastly, I thank our able Secretary General, our organizing secretary, our youth leaders, and every other participant, wherever you are. Be blessed, be blessed, and may God mightily bless you. Pamoja to Tafaulu. CCU. CCU. Pamoja. Siasa. Nisera Siofitina. Thank you and God bless you. So, just mute your mic, please, and I need to give my final remarks. I believe we had a very nice meeting despite uh, the fact that we had some challenges. Because this is especially in any meeting that we need to do, any meeting that has to go online. These are some of the challenges. But again, it was the first one, and I believe as we move forward, we'll be doing uh, uh, a combination of both physical and uh, virtual meetings. So I thank everyone on behalf of uh, CC Party and the Secretariat, and I believe that uh, we are going to move on together. As a Tennisana, for the teams in the counties, uh, don't leave where you are, we are coordinating you from there. We need you to fill the forms, as uh, the Secretary General has told you, and we also need to take care of other things that we need to ask uh, prior to this meeting. So, as I tell you, and without any further ado, I call this meeting off. As I tell you,
Riverside Music.